Hey guys, so I've actually been really curious in terms of how this N95 mask beats other masks in terms of protecting people from this current coronavirus. So in doing research about the N95 mask, I found a little bit about why it's so special. So according to the CDC, the N95 mask is effective at preventing 0.3 microns and above particles from entering in through the mask. That's super effective and around 95% effective according to researchers. So the CDC's guideline for protection against common viruses as well as potential bioweapons considers that these particles from these viruses will typically be around 1 to 5 microns big. Obviously that's way bigger than the N95 mask protects, but it's still useful to know. So here's the thing about the coronavirus. It's actually smaller than what the N95 mask prevents. The coronavirus is about 0.1 microns big. So in reality, the N95 mask, when it applies to this current coronavirus, is only around 89% effective. The next most effective material that you could actually find in your household is a vacuum cleaner bag. However, masks must allow for breathability. This really takes into account different potential filter options that we could use in our household. So in a combination with breathability, the size of the particles, there's also a third factor in terms of a DIY mask, and that is how closely it fits to your face. So a huge factor in these masks and their protection is the variable of how tightly they are sealed on your face. So another thing that I was really interested about, and I'm sure you're thinking about in terms of making your DIY masks, is what if you layer filters? Will that help at all in terms of protection? The answer is no. Not only will it not really help in terms of particles entering, but it also will prevent the user or the wearer from breathing, which obviously is a huge factor, especially for emergency medical providers. So right now, if you're looking to make DIY masks from home to help people, the actual best material to make them with that's protective and also breathable is cotton. So the typical cotton blend t-shirt is actually more effective than just plain cotton in preventing particles. I'm still looking into options in terms of what household filter could potentially be better than cotton. Today I saw an article that said actually children's diapers might be an option. So if you're sitting at home, you wanna do something you sew, my suggestion would be take out an old t-shirt, take out old sheets, and start using those to sew masks to help out with the health effort. Thanks for listening to my spiel. I hope it helps you, and I hope that we all find a way to help out in this crisis. And if you have any questions about DIY masks and the information I found, please message me. Good night, bye.